Welcome back, everyone, to another exciting episode of Colt Walker TV. Now, this is a good story. Check this out. This is the largest cash robberies in U.S. history. This is crazy. This is $30 million cash stolen this past Easter Sunday from a money storage facility in L.A. Now, I think it was an inside job. When you guys hear this story, you're going to be like, I think it was an inside job. I mean, let me know down in the comments what you think. And let me also let me know what you would do with $30 million cash. Like, this is incredible. Like, do you think that they, these guys have to lay low for a little bit? Do you think that they're going to start spending it right away? How do you what do you think they're going to do? Let me know down in the comments below. Now, these guys broke in on Easter Sunday and it wasn't found out until Monday morning. Now. They went in through the roof, they went through the ceiling of the vault, and out the side of the building. Now, <clears throat> it wasn't found out till Monday morning. So let's see what CNN has to say about this. And it involved big money, Mondo money. I'm talking $30 million in cash money stolen on Easter Sunday. It happened in northern Los Angeles at a money storage facility. What's that? Cash from businesses across the region, well, they're held there. Sources telling CNN the burglars broke through the roof, bypassed the alarms, entered the vault by cutting through the ceiling, and then exited the building by breaking through a rear wall. It's one of the largest cash heists in the city's history. I know, I know, you've probably got 30 million questions. So do I. So for starters, you ever see what $30 million in cash looks like in person? Me either. But here's a taste. This is $30 million stacked in $100 bills. Now, we don't have the denominations of the stolen cash, but in $100 bills, that would be about 661 pounds. If it were in $50 bills, more than 1,300 pounds. $20 bills, 3,300 pounds. And in case the burglars really ran into a challenge, $1 bills would have been 66,000 pounds. So about all those questions, who better to help than the person who first broke this story, along with a former bank robber? This is crazy, guys. So let me know down in the comments what you think it was, if it was an inside job. And please like, comment, and subscribe for more content like this. Thank you, everyone.